Hello everybody and welcome back. That was a really weird intro. I like I said the right thing, but the ca the cadence of my voice was wrong. I mean, hello everybody. That's not how I do things. That's bizarre. What am I doing? Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of the new save file. That's better. Felt right this time. Okay, we're gonna play as a vanilla character and we are gonna do some greed mode to try and do some stuff. Um, Eden greeden, Eden greeden, spleeden leeden, and we're gonna try and. Fill up that good old donation machine as much as we plausibly can. And yeah, we started with something and something. Um, Dimble, great. Ooh, that that active, that, that item, sorry, is really good. Uh, turns pickups and troll bombs into the, in the current room. Turns pickups and troll bombs in the current room into cards or nothing. Conversion chance amount depends on pickup type. Ooh. So probably pretty useless for us, unfortunately. Although, actually, wait. Does the does the item we have spawn troll bombs or does it just blow enemies up? I think it just blows enemies up. I'm a little bit scared because I, I like honestly, enemies blowing up is 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 scary. Uh but it should be pretty fun. It should be pretty interesting. Basically, all enemies explode on death now, which is uh, gonna mean hilarity ensues, but also I'm gonna get hurt a lot, so all sorts of fun. This is actually a tainted treasure room item, the tainted version of um, Curse of the Tower, I think. And the explosion size depends on the health of the enemy that we kill. But yeah, basically with this setup, of course, uh, there's gonna be a lot of enemies about, which means there's gonna be a lot of um, enemies kind of exploding all the time and blowing each other up which is kind of fun now i could ditch all of my money in the for the chance that some keys here uh, uh cards cards sorry but i think the risk considering it says the conversion uh, chance depends on the type of pickup penny is probably worth the least to the game i do not like this we've unfortunately started with reasonably bad stats so um it's not easy to kill stuff right now, but things that group up, helping us out, like this. Ah ha ha ha! This is a fun setup to start a uh, start an episode. I like this. Right, what items we got in here? Unfortunately, nothing worth anything to me. So I'll buy a key and check out my item room. Potentially pretty good if we can get some blue fly generation. But right now, not great. Let's try and do a reroll. <sighs> almond milk is pretty fun. I do like almond milk. We should get enough for it as well. I think I'll take almond milk. Even though I damage right now. Um, sorry, I fire right now, now, now isn't great, but our damage is okay. Shouldn't matter too much. Okay, these balls of death now explode. So we're not going to get much chance to fight this guy because he's just going to be firing those at us constantly. This means he's going to be around for the next boss, which is very problematic. Although we might get some some cross uh, contamination. There's two of them now. Are you kidding me? Oh God! It's not what I signed up for. Fuck me! This is so bad. This is gonna be a very long fight. I, realistically, we need the balls to all group up next to one of them and do some explosive damage, but I think that's going to be incredibly hard to happen. Luckily, the balls won't, do, won't have too much of a chance of exploding on us because they uh, they get knocked back pretty far. One minute, my goddamn, the crook of my elbow is like sweaty or something. It's bothering the shit out of me, which I know is a very, very niche complaint. And that leads to the question of the day. What's your niche complaint today? What's something that's slightly, ever so slightly bothering you about your body? Is it your brain? I bet it's your brain. It's always people's brains. Brains do some weird stuff. The wrong ones. This is torture. Let me out. <laughs> there we go. That's what we needed to happen. Oh, also remember bosses explode too. Yeah. 
Kind of forgot about that. They just fire so many balls, god damn it. Oh shit, bosses uh, exploding and destroying the floor is going to be very problematic later on. Like, very, very problematic later on. Holy shit, I didn't think about that. We're going to need flight if we can get it. Dude, just, just perish, please. You're thinking, this is taking forever. Why would you want almond milk? Because funny, that's why. Because the explosions are based on the enemy's health, not my damage. Dude, stop fucking moving. Oh, technology would be so good right now, too. You may think I'm crazy going for armor milk, but... Ow. Okay, uh, I might die, because that did a full heart of damage to me. I was not expecting that. Uh... Yeah, get ready for this run to probably perish very, very quickly, unfortunately, because I didn't realize that would do a full heart of damage to me, and I was playing very, very badly. I didn't really think that one single segment of Larry would blow up for some reason. I realize that now that that was foolish to think that. This better be HP. This better be PJs. It's squeezy. That's arguably just as good. Also, I will buy this. Probably want to buy the uh, stapler for the extra damage. I need to get rid of this thing, like, first off. Thank you. This is a little risky. Well, Mushroom Buddy's going to jump at me at the speed of light now, which I have to be careful of the explosions for. Oh my goodness, this is scary, but so fun. <laughs> Scary, but fun is the best way to be. Need Herming now. Herming would, would really drive this up a notch. At least I managed to clear out all of the uh, debris pretty easily. I need to get out of here. Oh, fuck. God damn it. So difficult to dodge. Got there in the end, though. Oh, right. Buy stapler first. Get key next. Pretty big damage bonus, to be honest. Okay. One segment will blow this entire guy up, so let's stay the fuck back. In fact... I'm going to leave this guy alive so that I can try and use him to kill the next boss. Which may seem foolish, but I'm going to give it a go. Might not work, he might not get anywhere near the, the other boss, but I feel like I have to try. Ah, come on. To be fair, this is another boss that's just going to blow itself up, so... There you go. 
Beautiful. That is quite a large hole. <laughs> We're gonna need flight very soon. I'm also gonna buy another one of those. That's very nice. <laughs> That's very, very good. Buy another key here. This guy's gonna be an absolute pain in the ass for us. Just because we have very limited space to move. There's also this guy that can plant bombs, but he doesn't seem to want to do that right now. Okay, there you go. He finally decided he wanted to. Big boom. Big boom. Okay, that's, that's pretty good for us. Right, let's get gone. This is, this is a weird one. Yeah, the fact that that grants homing could be very, very good. Although, it did seem that enemies that, that were, that procced that didn't explode, which I don't like. We are losing some explosive power off of the back of that. But we are gaining some homing, which I think is notable. Damn it, it's triggering way too often. I'm willing to lose that item. Um, I'm willing to lose that item for the enjoyment of the run, because that's just not fun. If enemies don't explode, that's kind of the whole point of all this. Also, multi-dimensional baby, fantastic when you've got, um, what's it called? I forget the name of it now. Almond milk, because it's basically most of your tears are gonna pass through it at some point. Is there four corners here? Okay, not four corners, but three corners. Alright, then there's a few of these fellas' heads diving about the place. This one's literally just a head. So is this one, but... Okay. Got a few pennies. Mother's Spine's good, but I think we need to roll for tier-based upgrades. Restocks the current shop. Ooh. Ooh. This could be broken. Yep. This is good. Very, very high shot speed. Means it's going to be way easier to hit our shots. Oh, fuck you. You big oafish bitch. Why'd you move like that? just you? It is just you. Good. It's still gonna be a bit of a pain though, aren't you? But, actually, not so much really, because you spawn a bunch of these fellas and I was gonna say instantly kill yourself, but didn't quite work out. You at least did some damage to yourself. Nice. Don't you dare give us a devil deal here. I will cry. Angel fellow with this many holes in the floor isn't great. Don't like the little, the little baby beam around either. Okay, the little baby did damage to him. I, I respect the little baby now. Angel deal, please. Thank you, but god damn. These explosions are going to get me killed very, very quickly. Uh, 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 not an item I want to see. I can't... I don't know how you can call that quality three. I've got to be honest. It's only a 9% chance. And it's an on-hit effect. Ugh. 
One hit effects are gross. Oh, fuck me. Getting out of the fucking room is taking forever. I like this mega shot speed, though. This is fun. We're going to have to save up some money soon, though, so... Phantom's enemies into poop. I like that. One heart container, three golden hearts. I like that, too. Ugh. Racism. Baby bender. Tower patch is probably pretty good here with the extra shot speed and stuff. Plus one damage. Is that a trinket? I'm not sure if that's a trinket or a card. Either way, I think I want it. With this many tiers, the chance to turn enemies into poop randomly. Pretty good stuff. Essentially a free insta-kill. This is tricky, this. So many enemies about. The jumpy boys don't make it any easier. I realize that technically the, the, the poops are also anti-synergy, but not in the same way. It's a lot less chance. Enemies that chase me to fucking get away, goddamn. from me, you mouthy fuck. Oh, I didn't even see you. I wasn't even looking. Bollocks. Ah, fucking stop, game. Stop. Oh, what the hell? Okay, I got a eternal heart. Oh, and I got an immortal heart. That's even better. Right, so take that. Is that just... Okay, that's really, really, really strong. That gave me a solid 1.5 damage up with uh, these tiers, which is kind of ludicrous. See, that gave that was an entire item, and that gave me 0.5. Okay, that was that's a very good trinket for us right now. I one more key, and I think we're going to probably start saving up from now on. But yeah, that is a huge damage up for this. My damage being 5, which is higher than our starting damage, with almond milk. Pretty nutty. Just need to make sure that whenever we kill something, we're at far enough distance, which the shot speed definitely helps with. Chain reaction's pretty beautiful. Skolex, is this Skolex? Nobody likes you, Skolex, Skolex, nobody likes you. You are a trash boss. I'm surprised the um, reworked foes and enemies hasn't done something to Skolex. Skolex is just everyone's, it's got to be everyone's least favourite boss in the game. It's just the epitome of waiting around for something to happen and not really being able to enjoy your build. He just never fucking pops his tail off. That hit me? What the shit? <laughs> it's just crazy. Oh god, we need flight so bad. Oh, this is bad. We just need to stay at the other side of the gap. Don't you dare get over here. Just the explosions are so large. Don't you dare come down this bit. Stay the fuck back. Trying to aim for him using his icon. There you go, I got him. Sadly, it didn't hit the other guy, though. I 
This is another boss that's really annoying too, to be honest. Not quite as bad as Skorlix for waiting around, but there's still quite a lot of waiting around. Okay, we have very much just won in a major way. I don't think we need to buy anything else from here on out. It's all about saving up now. <laughs> oh, baby. What is happening right now? Okay, unfortunately, the shot speed kind of nullifies the homing a little bit, but the damage is still real good. We can't really home with this much shot speed. There's a rainbow boy, hello. We're getting, we are getting a little bit of homing, just not as much as the game should be giving us. Two soul hearts from poops. Oh my god. <laughs> Already creating massive holes in the floor. What a fun run this is though. Oh my god, that damage with almond milk is obscene. Okay, that guy didn't really explode. Well, this one? Okay, that one did. This guy we kind of need in view. I'll probably take the devil card here. Just don't know why I walked into that. Wow, we got another Immortal Heart here. I'll leave that on the floor for now. In case we lose this one. We did indeed lose this one. Fucking god, the explosions. I always forget how large they are. Random Wisp. Okay, that's fair. Decent enough. Get out of here. I'm not even checking the shop. I want as much money as I can. I don't want any temptation. <gasps> Be so careful that enemies being close to me. Like, where do you sit in the room to have the least chance of getting spawned, something spawning on you? How are you not dead? Come on. <laughs> Bit of a hard room here. Techno pin's probably going to hit me from across the room. What on earth was that explosion? Come on now. miles away fuck off <laughs> oh wait the button's untouchable they broke the button i can't touch the goddamn button um is it c28 give c28 no 21 i'm just gonna have to check it trans c20 
Dude, the explosions are so big, fuck off. I'm nowhere near the what like what I think would be the explosion radius. And it's like, no no no. It's bigger than it's bigger than that. Right. Let's go. Let's goddamn go. I mean, I guess. How much will the devil card give me? It did actually give me nearly two damage. Nice. Okay. These don't explode on death, thank goodness. That would have caused a lot of issues if they did. The Gapers, however, very much will, and so will these guys. Although that's good for us, because they'll deal damage to him. What about these ones? Do these ones? Yeah, no, these ones don't either. Healing. Got a few of them into poop. Thanks for the nickel, buddy. I love the way he just spawns things at his feet that immediately blow up and damage him for a fuckload. Okay, now these are gotta go. But there's so many of them. Fuck. 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 Don't let them get anywhere near me. Okay. We got him! That was kinda of, that was kinda of crazy. That was that was really, really crazy. That's very good. I like that. Okay, we got a gem. We are good to go. I hope you guys did enjoy this one. I'll see you guys in the next one.